Alright brothers and sisters, this is the video on the difference between a one-way non-denominational church and a coexist non-denominational church. A one-way non-denominational church is someone who does not follow after denominations or any denomination that takes out of, out of the uh, KJV Bible and adds to the KJV Bible. A coexist non-denominational church is a not as a is a church that calls themselves non-denominational, but yet truly they accept all denominations. They respect all denominations. And truly they are not their own church. Although they call themselves a non-denomination, they make themselves a denomination by coexisting with all denominations. And that's the difference between a one-way non-denominational church and a coexist non-denominational church. I am a part of a one-way non-denominational church. Um, these are some denominations that are not of the, not of the Word of God. They're paganism. Mormons, Jehovah Witnesses, Hindus and Buddhists, Muslims, atheists, uh, Calvinist and Catholics. Atheist isn't really Christianity, but but of course, it is wrong. And sin and churches that preach that oh we all we are all sinners we all live every day and there's no way you can be a saint. You're gonna die a sinner, and still go to heaven. Those churches are false too. Every every church that preaches that is a false church. Doesn't matter what church it is, it's a false church that they preach that. Oh, we're all sinners. We're not saints when we become born again. And some churches don't believe that you can be born again at all. And that's blasphemy against the Holy Ghost. So, uh, any, let, let, let's say, uh, Trinitarianism. Now, I'm not saying that God cannot use this, uh, these certain denominations in any, well, I mean, of course he can't use this. Cross that out. I'm not saying he cannot use certain groups in different ways. But the thing is, if you're a part of these certain groups, you can only go so far. You can only go so far because they, a lot of them denounce, all of them actually denounce that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. All of them. And some of them just take away take away from the book of life and add to the book of life. And there's other churches that are not on here that should be on here. Other churches. See, uh, Catholicism is Trinitarianism. Any church that follows after any after the Catholic Church or any, or any of their doctrine such as their baptism titles, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Yeah, I believe in the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost as well, but I believe, it in, I believe in the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost in context. They are not three separate deities. See, Jesus is not the Father, Jesus is not the Word, and Jesus is not the Holy Ghost. The Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost are all one. All three bear record in heaven, and they're all and on all three of them are one and the same. Jesus is not any of those three. However, those three are made manifest in Jesus. Those three are the Father of Jesus. See, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost is the Father. See, the Father is Jesus' Father, the Word is Jesus' Father, and the Holy Ghost is Jesus' Father. They are all one and the same. Why God chose to separate it, I don't know. But the Word is, is the Father's Word, and the Holy Ghost is the Father's Spirit, Holy Spirit. So if you harmonize it in that way, then it helps you understand it better. However, Jesus is not the Father, Jesus is not the Word, and Jesus is not the Holy Ghost. 
the Word, the Father, and the Holy Ghost are made manifest in Jesus and chose to manifest his power in Jesus. Hallelujah. And that's how you read that in context. So if you follow after any doctrine that follows after this, you're following after paganism. So, again, one way a uh, non-denominational church is the ones who actually follows after the after what's in the Bible. Coexist a non-denominational church. They don't just follow after what's in the Bible. They accept all denominations. You can coexist with all different uh, Christian views. Doesn't matter if it's in the Bible or not. That's the difference between a one-way non-denominational church, which is the real one, and the coexist, which is the religious one. Now go in peace, brothers and sisters.